Yeah, get signed up. What are you waiting on? Slim drowned on purpose. Did he really? I don't think he did. Honestly, what, well, I, I wasn't right on top of his body, but what I was thinking and happened is like right now, when your character's out of breath, it takes like three extra seconds, even once you come above water for the game to realize like that, hey, you don't want to die and you're trying to catch your breath. It's silly. Uh, here we go. Okay. So, oh, boot camp. Yep, yeah, boot camp's hot. Let's go. Where the hell's my camera even at? I don't even know. JTX Sniper takes out Bev at boot camp. Oh, no. That was their chance in sauces. Oh, no. Okay, so Bev's out. We got Mike Burt left on his squad. Okay, here we go. Here we go. So we got Team 28 over here at boot camp along with Team 5, Team 7, Team 26, and Team 11. Boy, if Customs and Snow push in and take out Patriot and Sniper, they could really secure everyone an opportunity to bump up in placement. Loud Giraffe takes a nasty QBU shot from a Sniper. Patriot almost, oh, no, not almost, Im immediately smokes Mike Burt. Wow. That was an unfortunate headshot with an AK. Okay, so we got Team 7 by himself. Kanjik, well, where's your partner at? Kiki or whatever his name is. Uh, Toxic takes out Call Me Box and Instant Sauce with the M16. Where's that happening at? That's over at Camp Alpha. Man, it'd be really cool to have multiple screens up here, huh? Boom, and takes out his buddy too. Evil Mongorian takes out Team 16. Nine leaves goes down. Are there any more fights happening right there? And everyone else is kind of split up. Cow is a little bit there. We might want to rotate there. Uh, and then Paradise. Everyone else is pretty much soloed up. Okay. So you want to be paying attention for these fights, for Paradise, and for Cow. Kanjik out in the open. Wow, and not, not getting shot at all. That's, that's really lucky, honestly. To be between these two teams and not take any shots. Level one geared out of his mind, too. What's he rocking? High tops. He's got some knee highs right now. Uh-oh. It's, it's danger close right now. You're danger close, buddy. Oh! Takes out Sniper. Oh, man. Oh, man. If he was able to take out Patriot, too, that could have just thrown a wrench into everything. Where is his teammate, though? It says he got knocked only. Where is your teammate, dude? Oh, my God. You're just going to bleed out here. That's unfortunate. Uh, bye. Damn. He almost had him. He almost had him. He had a knock. He couldn't quite get the sauce. Now Reese. I can hear Reese now. Let's push. Let's push. He got knocked. They, they're going to heal. Boom. Frag comes out, but it snows. It's not going to be anywhere near close enough. They're above you already. They already know you're coming. Snows, watch out. He's above you. Uh-oh. Reese is going to push aggressively to the staircase. Ballsy play. He, he, did, he had to see him. He had to have seen him. Meanwhile, Loud Draft T28 is pushing in really close too. It's a 3v3 team fight. He gets one. Oh, and his buddy backs him up. Oh, no. Reese is down. Reese is down. Snow's got to back his buddy up. It's a 2v1 situation right now. They have the rooftop on him. They push in and Snow goes down. Oh, damn. GG's Team 11 for trying your best to take out Team 5. You got him, but you just couldn't hold it. Team 28, GG's on owning boot camp. Let's rotate over to resort. Uh, we just missed a couple kills. Fo Franco takes out Slim. Real Goompa takes out Shane Town. Hold on, hold on. No, Notepads finishes uh, Evan before we can get there. So that was Team Saint. No, not Team Saint. Excuse me. What was our team name? They did well a couple rounds ago. Uh, where are we going to rotate? Saint's going to get heals on his buddy. Okay, so he didn't lose his teammate. That's good for them. They're in a third place. Close to get points here. Let's rotate back this way. Let's go over to about Pine 9. There's a loot drop. Oh, I just heard some thunder. So rain is about to start drizzling down. Really challenge these teams on not what they got to listen for. Here comes the sketchy rain. Was it raining? It looks like it's raining. <laughs> Here comes the rain. I think Team 24 has... Did, did they get the loot drop? Oh, they must have went right past it. Huh. Okay, so this is Dilly Lights and Grump's going to rotate across bridge here. Uh-oh. Bang Bang definitely sees them across bridge, and they have compound. Uh-oh. Are they going to shoot? Now, it looks like they're going to hold their shots, but they're definitely going to call them. Oh, they're going to rotate around. So, Team 25 is going to rotate back around uh, where Team 24 just came from. Okay, interesting. Interesting tactic. Uh, both teams are still in the circle, so no worries there. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Camp Alpha's bridge is where we need to be at next. That looks like it's going to be a pinch city. Someone's already getting shot at. Birds is going to have some easy shots on them. Prolific and Mike Stan squad are going to have some bridge camp opportunities. Let's get up here. Okay, now we're on board. Uh, B June and Go Birds. 
who, if they stay here, uh, now it looks like Dirty Merkin and Drunk Penguin are going to rotate on the side side bridge. I guess it's probably a smarter play, right? Yeah, everyone just kind of take taking a minute, catch their breath, get chilled, get loot. Circle's not really forcing anyone to go anywhere yet. Damn, I can't believe that uh, Team Cyclone Esports got taken out, though, at uh, boot camp. That really leaves uh, Team Sane the opportunity to win here. So they're taking the Tuk Tuk. <laughs> He's taking the Tuk Tuk. <laughs> the one vehicle we can keep up with on camera mode. <laughs> oh, no. Shots are happening. Prolific and Mike Stan want to get involved. They really let Go Birds have it. Not enough to kill him. But this Tuk Tuk might not make it through. If they get their guns reloaded, they don't. They get each it. It finally reloads the gun. It's too late. No, it's too late. Oh, it's smoking. Can we get a sniper shot on it? Oh, oh, not enough to connect. Dang. Okay, so now Go Birds stopped early for his teammate. Where the hell are we at? Here we go. Go Birds stopped early for his teammate. So I think Mike Stan and oh no, they definitely know now. That was not a smart play by Go Birds. He's going to give himself an opportunity to let B. June come pinch him, but he's got to face a 2v1, and this is not a squad you want to go 2v1 with, especially not on FPP. He does have a good peak position. Can someone shut that vehicle off? Christ. Yeah, he wants to give his teammate opportunity to come on in. He's not going to be too aggressive, but Mike Stan and Prolific need to be. Now they know where he's at. We got to go push. We got to push because his teammate's going to come from behind. They're, they're telling each other right now. We got to go. Right now, B. June is going to have shots on him. He's got to be careful. Go Birds is really baiting them out to a good spot here if they do push in. Stan throwing some frag. It's always dangerous for anyone near the map. Not quite enough. Now B. June is in an awesome pinch city right here. No, but B. June's giving his position up. That's not the play you want to do. You should have held your spot and let them go after your teammate, I think. Now they rotate to water's edge. It's going to be hard to hear anyone now, especially with the rain. They're just really creating some distance with each other. I don't know if that was the play. B. June's on top of the rock. Did Mike Stan see them? He looks aggressive. I think he did see him. No, he didn't. Oh, but Prolific did. The shot doesn't connect, and Prolific almost goes, almost goes down. Mike Stan's not able to secure it with the AK. B. June's going to have a second to heal. SKS lets him cross shots out. Mike Stan takes a nasty arm shot. Mike Stan's pinch between a rock. Nice knock from Mike Stan on B. June. Oh, and he does connect on B Birds, but Birds claps back right in the kisser on the top of that head there. But easy, easy heal for Prolific. Here comes a frag. You're going to have to rotate left. Rotate left quickly, quickly. Oh, no. Three seconds, two seconds, one. The heal's done. They got... Oh, he gives it up. Oh, no. Oh, no. Prolific was almost able to secure the kill. Just not enough. And B. June is going to get healed for free. Damn. Team bums go down down i thought he was gonna stay committed to the heel to be honest i thought he had time to do it but we couldn't see the timer obviously we're just counting down on our heads dang that's an unfortunate dropout for team bums right there it's a good job by go birds in june keeping that alive all right so team 20 is pushing into team 24 this is penguin merkin Dr dilly light and grumps these people all know each other in real life or at least on twitch for for what i know all in the cool Xbox PUBG community. So it'll be fun to see these guys fight it out here. I don't know if they actually know where each other's at, though. Uh-oh. Dirty Merkin might not know, but he's kind of in, in a bad position out in the open. I think he did see... Yeah, he does see Grumps. Okay, they, they spot each other, maybe. Holding his shot. Dilly definitely sees him. I think Dirty just saw Dilly. Okay, so now they have eyes on each other. Boom. Letting that mutant fly. That mutant I absolutely hate it. I cannot stand the mutant. Olsen Knight takes out Riley Fetch in the head with the burl and takes out Henry Dick. Wow, good double clap. Ooh, God, nasty shots. Oh, nasty shots. Dirty Merkin goes down. Here comes the frag grenade to secure it. Look at the Kobe. A little too far. Penguin is in a safe spot here to maybe get some cover shots. What's Penguin got? A car 98. He's waiting for the right opportunity. He's got a Vector and a car 9. He can get a quick chest shot and let the vector rip and really do some damage here. Here he goes. He sees him. He's got the bullet loops in case he needs to reload faster. You got to hurt and save your buddy. Boom. Let it happen. Nice shot by Drunk Penguin. Now it's a 1v1 situation. 
Doesn't connect the second shot. He's got a heal, though, here. And Grumps knows it. He's going to get an easy push heal. And he might even be able to sauce Dirty Merkin before Penguin can get up because he's only got... Oh, he did a full med. No grenades? Oh, no, it's too late. You got to hold your position. Oh, man, I hate to see it. Dirty Merkin just in between them. Don't, please don't hit me, he says. Please don't hit me. What a grenade, though. Forces him around the rocket. Penguin can push that. He does. He's aggressive. Boom, takes out one. Reloads the vector. Oh, it's not enough. It's an ump versus vector. They both reload. Oh, no. Oh, Grump's not going to be able to get the heal off. Dilly Light might get saucy by a third party. Can he get around? If Team 28 gets a shot, Team 28 also knows these people in real life in the zoo squad. No, it isn't able to get it. Damn. Giraffe and Weasel almost got the sauce on Dilly Light right there. Whew, man. What a save. What a save. Okay, now we got Pontiac over here by himself. Let's rotate over. See how he goes against B. June and Go Birds. The same squad had just knocked out the bums a few moments ago. He might not even know they're there. He's in the middle, minding his own business. I don't think he knows they're there. Let's see. <laughs> Stan, you should have had the ump, man. You should have had the ump. <laughs> I was pulling for team bums, you were? Yeah. <laughs> All right, let's see. I don't think... Oh, Pontiac might have seen him. Uh oh, Bijun just Bijun just spotted him. Okay, now your position is given up. Birds is going to be aggressive in this push here. There was a big flare popped off just a moment ago. Wonder what's going to come in from that package. Do you get the armored UAZ on on Sandhawk if you shoot it outside the zone? I wonder. Armored UAZ might be an actual pretty good play for this map. Uh oh, Pineax about to get pinched. Man, you hate to see it. He might be able to get one in sauce, but he's letting these guys just surround him, do exactly what they want to do. Another flare pops off. We're going to have a lot of level three gear coming in. Bijun, he's like, I know you're in there, dude. Come on, let me get a frag grenade maybe. Yep, here's one. No, it's a car nine. Pontiac knows it too. GGS Swiss Roll takes out Care Bear at the Umpty Dumpty. Best gun in the game. Yeah, we got to outlaw that gun next round, huh? Or next match. Oh, here comes a Molotov. It's going to force him out. That will burn you alive. I know it from firsthand experience. Oh, no. There he goes. Talk to you later, Pontiac. <sighs> Hate to see it. GG's Team 19. There's the flare way out there. We're out there. Way out there. How now, brown cow? How now, brown cow? Uh, Real Goompa and Takiki are chasing. Takiki is the one who left his teammate by himself at boot camp. If he was there, they might have taken out Team Cyclone Esports together. But there he goes. Takiki does clap on Notepad and knocks, and now he's got a 1v1 to deal with. He's going to throw a grenade to give himself a second to heal, maybe. Not enough to connect. He reloads the AK. He's not even going to heal. He's going to hard peek it here. Nope, nope. Here we go. Now he's going to be smart. Get a little first aid off. Give Goompa a chance to push up a little bit. Does he hear footsteps? No, no. It's too late. He's alive. How is he alive? Goompa didn't connect that last shot. Now he rotates over aggressively. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Watch out, Takiki. He goes prone. Pro plays. Pro plays. <laughs> and it works. He goes prone and it works. Oh my God. Pro plays out here. Let's get across the map over to uh, Dat Boy in Bears at the edge of the circle. And it snows and hell is pinching them as a third party here. It's a, a 2v2v1 situation out here. Gee, I cannot believe he just went prone on him. All right, so now we got Dat Boy and Shooter Shepherd have Hilltop on Bear. Snows in Hell, that's a good distance between them, so he can really pinch Bear if he wants to. It looks like that's what his plan was. And they all have Circle Edge, too, so no real rush on that. Uh, they're going to rotate, keep rotating left, and they have a loot drop if they keep running this line. I think Snows is going to try to take advantage of that opportunity and wrap around Team 4 here. Uh, DJ Swiss Rolls is uh, what they're top, right? They're fourth place right now, fourth place, with 263 points uh, as of the beginning of this round. So if he takes this squad out, that can really open up the uh, the leaderboard for some other people to take the lead at this last round. He's going to disengage all the way, though. They'll just settle that for nothing. Okay. Um, <laughs> no one else is danger close to each other. Let's get some height here. We got Reckless pushing in from the back. GCR going to come from the zone here. 
So those two might run into each other. Where's the circle going to end, I wonder? I mean, it'd be nice if it ends here dead in the middle to make everyone kind of force on in, but it's probably going to pick favor one side left to right, huh? Let's see if they end up ended up getting that loot drop. Oh, shit. Not only do they get the loot drop, they also get shot at by Team 17. They might have been baiting that loot drop. Let's see. They, they did. Level 3 geared. Okay. What kind of weapons are we rocking? Is that a Groza? No, it's an ump. <laughs> might as well be a Groza. Uh, okay, did you leave the gun for your buddy? He's got a VSS and he has the AUG. There we go. That's one team, one dream. Where to share the care? Share the care? Sharon's care and share the loot? I don't know what I mean. Give me a break. Uh, so that was shots from Team 17. They're going to disengage from that. Wrap back around. A flare gun was popped off just a moment ago. I wonder where that's going to drop at. Special airdrops remaining. There's one remaining at the bottom right of my screen. That must be that one coming in. Uh, birds is rotating dangerously close to uh, to Dilly Light. I wonder if they're going to keep pushing that way or go to ruins. Let's see. I'm ready to zoom that way. Oh, zoom that way if need be. Everyone's a little spread. Team 12 and Team 18 are pretty close towards the edge. Shooter Shepard is good distance between. Yeah, everyone's really safe right there. Let's go to Team 12 and Team 18. Let's get over there. We got to go straight down first to go underground, and then that'll speed us up. Here we go. Oh, I went up a little bit too fast. A little too early, rather. Okay, right at the edge of the zone here. They're close enough that they have to hear each other for sure. So this is FPP. They got to be hearing footsteps at this point. No rain, though. It was raining earlier. Uh, it is a little foggy, though. A little overcast. So your, your view... Oh, shit. There goes Reckless. Lo knocking out QB. GCR is going to get shot in the back of the head here in just a second and does. Goes down. Saves his teammate Reckless. Good work by Team 12 right there. Wow. I was just about to say the uh, the fog does limit your view distance, so sniping is not as prominent on this particular weather mode. Uh-oh. The back edge corner now is starting to fight again. Let's see if we can get back over there. That's Team... What the hell? Oh, snow. Snow went down. Dang. And then I think over here, Team 27 and Team 17 were shooting at each other. Yep, they're engaging now, finally. Level 3 gear over here on the top of the hill. They both have decent cover here, so they got the hilltop to protect their heads. They just have rocks and trees, which is also good. Couple suppressed M4 shots doesn't connect. Another flare gun pops out from Team 2. 12 teams remaining, 23 left alive. Easy shots on Olsenite. He's going to go down by that AUG. If he's not careful, he's able to get to cover. That should have given Power Drill an opportunity to get some cross shots, but he didn't even peek, it looked like. Yeah, Shooter Shepard and that boy school is really favoring this hilltop here. They got to... Team 17 has got to get a new position. Maybe wrap around, spread out a little bit. I don't know. There's some smoke grenades as bait because they're just right now just being waited on. As soon as they move, boom, boom. See, a couple shots as soon as he moves. Dilly Light, Go Birds, and Tox are going to be really close to each other here in a moment. We might need to rotate back behind us. Olsenite does make a run for it, and it looks like he actually makes it. Wow. And they even let Power Drill go by himself. Okay, Grumps does take out Go Birds behind us. Let's rotate back here. See if uh, Go Birds is going to be able to get res by B June, but now he's going to get third party by AD if they're not careful because they definitely heard those shots. He does get an easy res, but he's going to be at 75% health and, and probably less armor to, uh, to assume. Dilly Light's pushing pretty aggressively with a frag grenade. Tries to get it primed. It's not going to quite be far enough, is it? No, it's a flashbang. Just kidding. They're going to be rushed right into the right side where Toxic and Monogram, Mongorian, Mongorian, what the hell am I saying? Mongorian have a, a pinch set up. There's some, there's some of the bait, the bait smoke grenades I was telling you about. And sure enough, Bijun caught out in the open by the pinch here. Now it's Go Birds on two, and Go Birds goes down. Damn, Team 19's eliminated, uh, but Team 24 didn't get any of those points, unfortunately for them. Now Team 24 is going to have a little fight with Team 2, which is going to bring in Team Sane back behind them. The AUG shots are still happening. Finally, Olsenite goes down, leaving it a 2v1 back there that we were following a moment ago. Team 28, Giraffe, and Weasel have the hilltop opposite side of all these squads, so no one knows about Team 28 or Team 22 yet. Dilly and Grumps are trying to play a little safe on the edge here. Dat Boy does take out Olsenite and Sauces on Power Drill still left alive. 
everyone's doing good on circle out here. No one has to really rotate rotate in except Sane, which they need to be the safest because they're third place before the round before this round started. So they have the most to lose here. Let's see. I think Sane's going to be right behind Grumps and Dilly here in just a moment. And the rain's not happening, so they should be able to hear it coming. Let's see. Those shots are going to confuse everyone. He's leaving himself super exposed. Team 17 got eliminated to play zone. What a, what a pro. He said, I'm not giving you the kill. I'm going to let the zone get me. No points for you. Yep. Uh, Twitch saying does see him. They got to get into the circle, though. He No, don't waste a frag. You're going to tell them your position. Ah, okay. It's a good shot, though, by his teammate to help back him up. Oh, God, the VSS. Who's going to get the points? Twitch saying does get the 14 points. Wow. What the hell? Who is that? Oh, win. Team 27's right here, too. I didn't even see them coming up. So now we got all four squads here, or the la these last four squads here. Danger close. Weasel squad still got a lot of distance. Hopefully they have sniper rifles out there. Evil Mongorian's wrapping around the left side. Toxic's pulling his, his back on left side. Uh-oh. Taking shots out from the VSS. That's from Twitch Sane squad. Tox is about to get really aggressive on that boy, I think. Oh, is he disengaging? Oh, they don't even see him. That boy had no idea they were behind him. They could have easy shots here. Yeah, see, they're, they're engaged on Twitch saying they're trading shots. That's unfortunate. He's about to get third party so hard right here. No, he didn't. He didn't push. He didn't push. That boy's schools is pushing up against Blue saying maybe to get a frag out because they know they're behind one of these two rocks. And now Weasel and Giraffe are getting involved. So there's like, oh, shit. There's four squads. We've got to push one of these guys. We can't sit still. Here we go. And they do push. Uh, Blue Sane gets a knock. Boom. One more left. It's a 2v1. Blue Sane goes down in return. Twitch Vinsane has to get involved, but he doesn't. He gets sniped in the back by Loud Giraffe. And, and Twitch Sane squad goes down. Now, is that boy squad going to get third party? No, Toxic can't quite see them. Hey, baby. Callie is here. Callie's head is wet. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, some shots are connecting right now. It's not good. Giraffe and Weasel have a good position still on Hilltop. No helmet for Shepard. No! You had to have seen your buddy get sniped right there. The enemy gets sniped right there. So now he's got no heals. No, no helmet. Excuse me. He's got to get rezzed again. And that boy knows he's in a tough spot. We're in a real pickle here, Dick. His back is barely covered. Weasel's going to push into this right side, wrap around them. Where's the rest of the squad at? Oh, speaking of the rest of the squad, Bang Bang is now Team 25, top of AD Toxin, Evil Mongorian, giving pressure off of the squad back there to get rezzed. DJ Swiss Rolls is going to roll on in who late to the party. Reckless and Team 7, nowhere near to be found. Not playing too aggressive, though. They're just trying to look for some safe shots. Weasel Squad, on the other hand, is really going to push hard around Shepard and Dat Boy, and I think that's probably the best play they can make right now because they have Circle. They want to eliminate this team so their backside's covered. Oh, it almost connected. That was a good uh, suppressed sniper shot with the M24. The VSS is dangerous. You don't want a heartbeat for that long, though. Weasel, be careful. Giraffe's going to get a Molotov out here to destroy some frames. Here comes a Fragonary to prime it. Maybe a little bit shorter. You might connect it here. It might blow up on them. It was a great grenade. Primed the perfect amount of time. And on that note, they're going to push in aggressively as hell to finish this uh, Dat Boy school squad. Oh, okay. I was say, who the hell threw that? So there you go. Seven points goes in. It's a 2v1. Takika comes out of nowhere and takes out Reckless and Dumb Boy. Holy hell. Takika out of nowhere takes out Dumb Boy and Reckless from the top hill. 80 Toxic letting him have it. Suppressed with the, what is it, an ump or an M4 up there? That boy takes out Swiss Rolls with the VSS. He's completely disengaged and gone after a different squad. Is he going to get the secure? No, he doesn't, but the other team helps him get seven points. Bang, bang, and kitchen knock out Bear, and that gives that boy's school seven points for his knock earlier. So now we got a 2v2, v1, v1, v2. That boy's school drinking some Red Bull. About to get jittery out of his mind. Popping some painkillers, some Skittles, wrapping some bandages up. Giraffe squad can now move on in. Come on, Zeus squad. Come move on into the circle. None of the squads are in circle here. Oh, and that boy's not even playing around. He says, I'm going to come back and avenge my buddy from a minute ago. That VSS is a dangerous gun on this map. 
See, right now it'd be cool if you could cue the rain and it'd be heavy, heavy rain and like mist and shit so that the squads have a really a tough time seeing this last circle. Uh, nice shots on the VSS again. Hope that boy school has some ammo left because he's letting them all fly out that magazine. Trying to rotate around. You got 28 seconds to get the circle. Literally none of the squads are in circle. You'll have to all move in 24 seconds. No shots connect there. He's trying to go for a height on him, but I think he's putting himself into a worse position here. He's trying to get an easy peek in this tree. Yeah, but you can't do that. The tree's not big enough. Oh, and he almost takes out Big Bang, but would it have mattered? I don't know. I don't know if that was the right call. Uh, GG's to Team 25, eliminate Team 27. Now you guys have to move in, but now you've brought in the attention of Team 2 back towards you because they know you're injured from that fight and they want to gate, gate camp you. And they are. None of the shots really connect in the one little shot to the left there. Takika is here to steal some kills in a moment though, just like he did a few minutes ago. And he's looking, he's looking for a nice even shot. Boom, a couple go out. One connects on Kitchen. Kitchen might go down to the zone here. Bang Bang gets taken out by Toxic. Toxic, I'm not even trying to secure it. Let the zone do it for me. Evil says, I'm going to go. Nope, just kidding. I'm going back. We got to run for circle, man. We can't die to the circle. Oh, and Sleepy Weasel has a good position. No, but it's not good enough. He gets taken out. Team 2 is pushing through the blue, shooting as they're sprinting. Loud Giraffe is a 2v1 situation. He goes down. Evil has a safe chance to heal. He doesn't heal. He says, I'm going to get up and get Kitchen. Boom, one shot. It's a 1v1 situation. A 1v1v1, excuse me. Oh, Karma, you got to reload. You got to reload before you push that. GG's to Sleepy Weasel and Loud Giraffe. They ended that with five kills. They played that round incredibly safe and smart towards the end. And with five kills and take home first place 70 points. Callie, what do you have to say for that? You can see it. I got nothing to say, Dad. GG's involved. GG's. <laughs> That's a wrap, guys. That's round.